One of the two new units added to the Golden Pack is the Manatee. It is a teal foil traditional scaler but with a twist. It takes 4 damage to buff the unit in front of it for plus 2 plus 2. This actually enables a lot of synergies with new food. Potato blocks the damage twice, Banana lets you summon a monkey in your team, and Peter Bread is a gigantic permanent HP buff. It also works with a couple units like the Silk Moth or Crane. I think this unit is a good addition to the Golden Pack as it lacks classic single target scaling and it is actually pretty fun to use. Enjoy! Okay, we're back. We're back playing some real runs. Side of battle, give some more HP. Ah, oh, these are nice. I guess we'll go for one. The eggplant in front? Yeah, but what uh, What does the door head ant in front do? <laughs> That's what I don't know. We'll take a boost. Because to me, door head ant in front sounds like it doesn't do anything. Does it not jump? No. <laughs> Okay, I guess I should have guessed that. Okay, let's see. Silk Moth, please. I guess. Might as well take an extra 1-1. One, one. Okay. I should have swapped these two around. Nice. Oh, no, not you again. Oh. Next, that Silk Moth killed us. Get our HP back. That's nice. Really wish we would have had that... Uh, that Moth though, so it works. Yeah, it works, it works. If we didn't get the skin of all, definitely would have went Lizard, because it's pretty fun. Also works well with this. Egg. Mmm... Don't head and no thank you. Come on, I'll take a silk moth, a level one silk moth. Take that. Stout. Oh, we got one. I'll take it. Level three silk moth. Yo, sandwich. Thanks so much for following, man. Much appreciated. Look at the stream. Egg. Nice. Okay, early kind of foul is pretty powerful. So I guess we can mess around for a bit and still win, which means yes please, yes please, more of these. Okay, so um, Silk Moth level 3 would give us plus 3 HP when uh, and the Manatee hurts itself, so that would, that would be a plus 2 plus 2 for only minus 1 HP on the Manatee. <laughs> Sounds pretty good. Yep, let's keep rolling. I want more of them. Yes, please. Level 2 stout. I love it, but... I'll keep it. I don't know, man. I love stout, but... Ooh, sea urchin. Okay, at least we had enough attack for that. Let's see. <laughs> Okay, if we buy and sell stones, I guess we can get some useful stuff, but I would rather just keep them for... Hmm, weasel for more gold. Level 2, yes please, do it like this. Actually, if we buff our Silk Moth, we can just keep it. Okay, technically I want to play a Silk Moth plus Manatee, thinking not the Guinefowl run, right? That's nice. But we can't really use it. Gonna sell two units, stout and someone that I don't want to get rid of. So I think we're gonna let go of the macaque. Yep, there you go. That's what we do with our gold next round. And we just need a silk map. Okay, I'm probably gonna level up my stout on round six just for a chance to get a manatee. Actually, even if we get a manatee, we don't really have a unit that we wanna uh, buff just yet. So we, we'll, yeah, we should wait. Eggplant, again, I'll take this. And we just wait, basically. I guess we roll. Yeah, I should have rolled more for Avocado. Now we get Ospreys. We actually want to play with them. Don't get them. Let's see. 
you in front. Guess you gotta kill level one thingy. Good enough. Oh wait, this guy. Sergeant Fish now gives only HP and a ton of it. I don't know what to do with it though. Used to be plus two plus two, or plus three plus three, yeah plus three plus three, now it's plus six plus twelve plus eighteen HP. I guess you could use it pretty well with the gorilla from the macaque, just to make sure you always get the full coconuts. Other than that, want some more health abilities I suppose. Guinea fowl, such fish. Let's see, wolf. Well, got another chance to get something nice out of this. Mm. It's not terrible. Okay, we do. Sergeant Fish plus Camel. <laughs> oh god. Okay, I like this African Penguin. I guess I'm just gonna give it a view. Unfortunately, you have trash stats. Which means let's roll. We need another Egyptian Vulture. There you go, there's this guy, but the problem is, we don't want to buff this vulture just yet, we need another one so we can get it to 6-5 and then start buffing, otherwise it's kind of a waste. Sergeant Fish prescription. <laughs> okay, like this penguin, and... I can get some stats now, but... Gotta sell one of you, guinea fowl is kind of our win condition, unfortunately. Cock stuff like this. It's not too likely to get the vulture though. We've got 12 units and with frozen. Okay, it's good. Let's just get interesting sound effect. Ah, let's buff the wolf because nah, it's not a good idea. I guess we can do this, but the same time, sorry, we keep scaling this vulture. It kind of sucks though because. Mm, you need a faint ability behind it. If you keep manatee, it's not gonna do too much. I think we're just gonna buff guinea fowl so we can stay alive. Okay. Terrible thing, but there you go. Only 2 HP to get this. Maybe we'll get a... Oh wow, we gave this guy the freest coconut on earth, but uh, it's fine. We had 7 attack. Anyway. Oh, ah, man, one damage off. Well, that's the one one that would have. Okay, let's see. Manta Ray. No. Sea Lion. We can buff a Sea Lion. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna keep you, my friend. We can buff a Sea Lion. Just more stats on our team. We have invaded Natural Fries. That was a Noble Fries. Well. Don't disagree. What are these? We'll take it. More manatees. Eventually, we're just gonna be the HP reset, I suppose. There's the vulture. Okay, so we don't really want potato and manatee. We already have silk moth to use it with. Okay, so this is gonna give one attack defense behind. Yeah, sure. Buffs our silk moth as well. Okay, eventually, we're gonna want potatoes on this guy. Excuse me, what is this? Okay. I'll take it. Okay, we've unlocked tier 5. I guess we can buff a fire ant again. That would be the best unit to get stats on too. Eggplant. I will definitely take those. Warthog, that is just perfect. And I suppose we'll, um, oh, wait, 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 we gotta do this now, because it takes 4 damage for us to dies, and then the silk map doesn't, yeah. Okay, <laughs> that would have been a disaster. Okay, we've got something. It's not terrible, but it's not amazing either. Level 2 this guy with a million snipes. Jesus, man, the level 3 don't have any HP. Silk Moth level theme. I don't know if we've seen more than. Might have skipped past one. Possibly. Okay. 
We unlock Peter Bird next round. We can honestly keep stones. I think we will. Okay, we'll take it. Level 2 bombs, that's nice. Nah, let's go for the... Okay, take that as well. Let's go for the... Um, Peter Bird, not potato. Some stats, unfortunately, we lose this one again. Our team is not that great. Right now, we still have the HP to work with, though. Let's see. Oof, we gotta go for this, right? I'll still buy and sell these. Okay, I guess we're tier 6 now. Eh. Okay. Level 3. Not worth investing 9 gold in it anymore. It should have been level 3 late game. This gives us 2 triggers. We don't really want 2 triggers. Okay. Do you need that pillow bread? Okay, level 3 this guy, that's a ton of stats, that's unfortunate. Still has a one shot and we finally have good enough stats to at least stop losing. Nice. Grizzly bird, not needed. Pretzel, we have a tier 1 in our team. Tomato, that's decent. Chocolate. Okay, next round we absolutely need something for our mana team. Could you see land behind as well? Just to make you give HP to the thingy. Yep, that's why we bought tomato. Should we have an easy fight ahead of us now? Yep, probably would have won anyway. With the level 2 what hog. Okay, won't be... Okay, I guess we give a potato. Really would have loved if we could have found the pretzel, but let's take this for now. I guess we could do... No, wait, no, we can't. Would love to buff its HP, but... <laughs> we gotta keep scaling the attack. Okay, screw it. Let's, let's get HP for one round. And we'll use Pida. When this guy has 5 HP, right? Okay, so I guess I'll just roll. Level 3. Okay, that's too many. <laughs> also, mods. Oh, thank you. And we've got a lot of rounds to play. This is nice, but... It's not really an incredible late game team. So... My tomato is in the back, will not have made too many too much of a difference. I didn't get to use the potato. But we've got enough stats. Okay. Oh wait, we can just do this. Would have been nice if we okay we take this. Peter bread, thank you very much. And we all well maybe we can get a level 3 mana tea. There you go, plus 15. Now we don't have to worry about its HP anymore. We can just throw more Peter Bears on it. And eventually we'll have 50 HP. Level 3. Popula boy. Please give attack to this guy. Nice. Okay, never mind. We've got enough uh, enough stats. Okay, let's try to get our thingy to level 3. If we see Peter Bird, I'm definitely taking it. That's just amazing. Like... Come on, man. That's plus 11 HP. <laughs> Silk Moth is important. Yep, definitely for mid game. Could definitely sell it now. We probably will. Because this could just be any unit with 50 50 now. Might as well get uh, an actual unit. 8 wins. Well, I guess this is, is not as weak as I thought it would be. Because this guy just has. Crazy stats from the manatee and the sea lion. <laughs> nice combo, I suppose. Peter Bread? Come on, man. We have to. Well, 
There you go. Another warthog. Warthog on warthog. Nah. Level 3, I suppose. Next round. Okay. Well, I guess we're taking this to insane levels. We don't need level 3 warthog, that's for sure. 48, 50. <laughs> I guess, but at the same time, we don't really need it because what fuck just. Oh no, what is terrible? That's so many stats lost. Okay, I actually thought about that. Oh man. I actually thought about that a couple of rounds uh, earlier, but I forgot about it. 6 HP, nice tomato. Okay. I think I'm just going to take this. And gonna risk losing the tomato again. Don't need pita bread. Sell sea lion. Can keep it in the back. Give some HP to our units now. But yeah, we could. But I, I, I like the. I don't know what to call them though. I don't know the. The. The water dog team. Okay. Fortunately. Okay, we got the stats first. There you go. Should not have too many more problems. Okay, just a faint, uh, faint team activated by uh, Sea Lion and Manatee. Well, it could go away, I suppose. Last fight. We don't need this. We don't need Silk Moth. We can basically have anything we want in the back. Should probably take the Cobra. Can't really give it this. I guess we can buff someone else. This guy's 50 50 now. I wonder if this works. Let's, let's test it. Chocolate cake. Eh, just give me this. Only big silk, silk moth mantis label? No, absolutely not true. You've got potato. You can just combine another one from the shop. It's not true. Silk moth is very good, but it's not the only thing that. Makes it makes it good. And there you go. Incredibly strong faint team, thanks to our easy vanity scaling. Interesting unit to be added to the new golden pack. I like it. Okay, pretty good team with the walls as well. Make it uh, buff its HP as well. Good game. That was nice.